Thank you. We will make America great again. Get out and vote. Thank you, Indiana. Thank you. Thank you, Indiana. We love you. of Hillary Clinton's campaign. It's just one more way that the system is rigged. A big way, really a big way. Reporters who work for these outlets like the Washington Post or the New York Times may think of themselves as journalists, but they're actually just cogs in a corporate political machine. The dishonesty of the New York Times is unbelievable. The dishonesty of the Washington Post is unbelievable. The dishonesty of all of those cameras, so many of them, not all of them, is unbelievable. The emails show the New York Times, the Boston Globe, Univision, a third-rate reporter named John Harwood. What a third-rate reporter that one is. And remember he did the debate and made a total fool of himself? He's of CNBC, all doing favors for the Clintons. And reporters smothering the Clintons with praise. Why? Why? You saw Hillary on the debate stage, you think? Jesus, that you raise up a man for such a time as this. God, we ask you right now that your choice is this choice. We believe, Lord God, that you ordain things. You said all authority is of you. Now, God, I ask that you would touch this man, Donald J. Trump. Give him the anointing to lead this nation. We thank you, God, that as a room full of clergy, a room full of leaders, a room full of business owners, mothers, wives, husbands, fathers, we ask for help. And we ask you, God, to let that help be in the form of the next president, Mr. Donald J. Trump. We ask you, God, to bless him, keep him safe, give him the wisdom and the strength to lead this great nation. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank y'all so much for letting me go a little bit longer. God bless y'all. interest is mail in those ballots and get out to vote on November 8th. All you have to do. Oh, I wish
wish those cameras would... Hey, would you do me a favor, fellas? Span the room. Span the room. Go ahead. Span the room. Span the room. Pretty amazing. Place is packed. New record. Place is packed. They never show our crowds, never. Maybe I'll just wade into the crowd. Maybe that way though. They never. Tonight when you go home, because I just looked behind, the smallest section is right behind me. Because we have the flag and the flag of Colorado. So we have, so all you see is my face and the few people, but they're gonna become movie stars, very attractive people. You're not gonna see this because they never show it. Because it's bad to show it, because if they show it, they're gonna see what's happening. And they don't see that this is going all the way up to the rafters. And we love our flag, but I think I'm going to move it a little bit in this direction next time. Because they're going to show how many rows. Nice crowd. Nice, but do you understand what I'm saying? Uh, my people don't get it. My people don't. They don't get it, my people. But if they would span the crowd, and this is what we have no matter where we go. It's only dictated by the size of the arena. Right by the side. We went to Pueblo today. We had a tremendous crowd. Right. All dictated by the size of the arena. And I want to thank our fire marshal who was fantastic.